In this video, we are going to solve one more gate problem related to root locus. We can observe this problem figure shows polar plot of a system, the transfer function of the system is. They given polar plot, we need to select the relevant transfer function of the system for this polar plot. So, first of all, you just observe this polar plot, this is very important problem given for 2 marks in gate 2004. You just observe this polar plot. So, here according to this polar plot, the plot is having magnitude 5 at 0 degrees when omega is equivalent to 0 and this plot is having infinity magnitude at omega is equivalent to infinity and it going to touch this 90 degrees line. So, that means when omega is equivalent to 0, when omega is equivalent to 0, the plot magnitude is equivalent to 5 at an angle 0 degrees and when omega is equivalent to infinity, when omega increasing like this and tending to infinity, it is going to touch 90 degrees line with magnitude infinity because somewhere it will touch, we do not know. So, that means we need to consider infinity. So, this is the data we got from this polar plot. Now, you can observe the options, you can observe the options, all options are in numerator polynomial only, there is no denominator here. So, we can take our transfer function, open loop transfer function like this, g of s is equal to k into 1 plus s tau. This is the standard transfer function in this form. So, now where k is the value of transfer function at omega is equal to 0. We know the value of transfer function at omega is equal to 0. Value of transfer function, magnitude of transfer function at omega is equal to 0. That means g of j omega is equal at omega is equal to 0 means g of j 0 is equal to 5. k is equal to transfer function at omega is equal to 0 or magnitude of transfer function at omega is equal to 0. If you consider omega is equal to 0, g of j 0 is equal to 5. So, by this we got k is equal to 5 we found k is equal to 5. Next, we need to find out this tau. For this, I want to substitute this value. I know when omega is equal to 10, that means g of j 10 is equal to 45 degrees. At 45 degrees, omega value is equal to 10. They given at 10 at omega is equal to 10. You just replace this s with omega then you can know. So, this is the thing we need to find out. So, general standard one is this. When we are coming to polar or Nyquist, we need to replace s with j omega and according to the given polar plot at omega is equal to 0 that means constant term is equal to 5 with an angle 0 degrees. So, whatever it may be k is equal to 5, the magnitude of the transfer function at frequency component is equal to 0 is nothing but constant. So, that is why I consider k is equal to 5. Now, g of j 10 is equal to 45 degrees they given. I want to substitute this j 10 in omega. That means in place of omega, I want to substitute 10 here. So, in this formula if I substituted, so if you know g of j omega formula, you can write for g of j 10. How we can write for g of j 10? Wherever you can see omega, there you can write 10 with 10. So, here k, you know k. So, 5 into 1 plus j 10 tau is equal to 45 degrees. So, now the angle here is equal to 45 degrees. So, how we can find the angle? So, tan inverse 
b by a we need to consider so tan inverse b by a means so tan inverse 10 tau divided by so a means 1 is equal into 45 degrees now here this implies I am sending this tan inverse to this side tan inverse this side means tan 45 so 10 tau is equal into tan 45 tan 45 is equal into 1 tau is equal into 1 by 10 so that is equal into 0 0.1 we got k value and we got tau value so you just represent in standard transfer function so then if you represent in standard transfer function then that will be like this g of s is equal into k into k means 5 into 1 plus 0.1 into s so 5 into 1 plus 0.1 into s will be the answer for this problem you can see which answer is suitable for this so this answer is suitable what you need to do means according to the options given you need to consider a standard transfer function if you are having any denominator so like that you can consider so for example if you are having denominator also here you are having only poles if you are having zeros also you can consider like that divided by 1 plus s tau you can consider like that s tau 1 or s tau 2 like that you can consider so according to that you can evaluate and you can get the answer for this type of problems so for constant term the value at omega is equivalent to 0 the magnitude of the transfer function at omega is equivalent to 0 can be treated as constant term so k you can take it as 5 and according to the middle value given I am tracing this tau value unknown value so by substituting the tau and k in standard function I am going to get the final answer or relevant transfer function which given this polar plot.